This was really embarrassing. So I can't believe I didn't think twice about a floating dock slash massage table like on the water in the cave. I can't believe I didn't think about this, but it was a beautiful concept. It's a cave with tents on floating docks in the water. I threw it. Fancy babies, guess where we are? As if you couldn't tell from the little temporary intro for this vlog, we are in Bermuda and me and Colin are here to celebrate our four year anniversary. We're celebrating it in two days. So I'm gonna fancy vlog before our anniversary because I just don't wanna be like, I don't know, I don't wanna have a camera in his face the entire time we're like having our anniversary. So I'm gonna keep that private, but for now, I'm going to fancy vlog. We've been here for three days so far. So we're basically adjusted. We know our way around and I think it would be fun to take you guys with me today and tomorrow with the things that we're doing. Well, we just had the most amazing, beautiful breakfast ever okay like it was just so delicious and now that our bellies are full we are going to pack our stuff and go to horseshoe bay i mean we do live on a resort like we live on a beach we spent like our time at the resort for the first three days and now we're like we kind of want to venture off so i'm going to bring you guys with me while we venture off from the resort and to horseshoe bay and then tomorrow at the resort i have like spa services and we love a good spa day on the fancy vlog channel so i'm going to take you guys to do that also later when we get back from horseshoe bay i'm gonna go try to swim in this like crazy dark cave that looks so spooky but it also looks like it's from h2o like you know when they go to mako island and they go in the cave and like the moonlight goes through the cave and they turn into mermaids well i'm gonna swim in this dark cave i'm so scared too but you know what hopefully i become a mermaid but without further ado, I'm gonna get ready. I'm gonna like probably put my hair back in some braids or something because this is a lot of hair I'm dealing with and swimming in the ocean, it ain't cute. So I'm gonna go do that and we're going to head to Horseshoe Bay. And I'm so excited to bring you guys with me. So this is like not a regular swimsuit. This is a swim dress. And for those of you who don't know what that is, it's like, I don't need to wear a beach cover up. Like this is already like a cover up, but it's also like a dress and it's swimsuit, it's like swimsuit material. It's like a one piece, but like with a skirt. And look at this taxi. I'm gonna sit on the opposite side just to be that dick. Look at this camera Colin has. away from everyone because it's a public beach horseshoe bay so like we're hiding our things back here and we can come dry off back here get some private time maybe make out a little bit stay out in the sun see what i'm saying see what i'm saying all right let's go swim island boy up here who's climbing but he's about to jump off this tall rock ready careful good job baby I got so nervous <laughs> Thank you. 
So after a really long morning, a really long and fun morning, um, we got back to the hotel or the resort from Horseshoe Bay. And now we're gonna go swim in a cave. Yes. In this resort, there's like this cave and it's so freaking cool, guys. I'm so freaking scared to go swim in it. It's just really, really scary and you'll see what I mean. It looks like there's like a shipwreck there or something. So we made it to our favorite restaurant in Bermuda, except we usually sit out there, but it is just so humid and hot out, and we've been walking, so we're just gonna eat in here tonight. Yes, yes. Everyone speaks Irish here. I can't do that accent. I can do Australian, I can't do Irish. Oh yeah, guys, look at my Bermuda nails. The last nails I showed you guys were um, the Starbucks nails. And now they're mermaid nails because I'm here in Bermuda. So Colin got a chicken pot pie and I got some grilled chicken and veggies. That looks delicious. I know, doesn't it? Yours looks really good too. So we're about to leave a tip for the waiter. And look how beautiful these Bermudian dollars are. They're so gorgeous. Wait, that's St. Mark's yeah. Cathedral and there's palm trees. And there's frogs and like swallows or whatever. The Aww, church. Another church. So pretty and they're so thin and you can't tell in this lighting, but this is pastel yellow and these are mint. I love like the string. Yeah, what's it feels so cool. Like I feel like there should be ASMR with like Bermudian dollars. Should look all just now. 
Looks like we're doing some kind of like drug deal with this light. <laughs> So we're back at the resort and there's these kitties. Salem doesn't Aww. like, this is Salem, I named her Salem. She doesn't like anyone except for me. She doesn't go near anyone. She hisses at everyone. Salem, come here. Come here, honey. I must really be a witch though, cause she literally hates, she just, she, did she just hiss at you? She doesn't like anyone except for me. Hi, hun. I'm a witch, that's why. Hi, Salem, honey. Salem, girl. Did you fart? No, it was a tree frog. Oh my god, you farted. I didn't. Yes, you did. I didn't. Yes, you did. <laughs> I can't get this. No. Look who followed me. Salem. You can't even see your face. Alright booze, so I'm gonna <laughs> I'm going to take off my makeup um and we're gonna go to bed mm -hmm. and then tomorrow we're actually waking up we're waking up at like 4 a.m. because of a surprise video we're filming in the morning. I'm sure you guys can take a wild guess on what we're filming. It's not a vlog, it's a music video, but it's not for like an original song, it's for a cover. I probably have that video up right now while this vlog is up because knowing me, I get way too excited about things and I just, I just go upload. It's speechless from Aladdin. He's crazy, crazy. So I wanna go to bed. Because I'm drinking monsters. Don't, we have to be up at 4 <laughs> What? It is 10.42 p.m. and we have to be up at 4 a.m. for this video shoot. So I have a feeling Colin's just gonna pull an all-nighter. He's still eating. Well, that's not buffalo chicken, this is salsa. No, get away. <laughs> I just had a nice cup of tea. We went to a supermarket and I got a bunch of tea and like extracts to make the most perfect tasting tea. And I know I sound like such a like tea coffee junkie, but we're gonna go to the palm court, which is like the little like food court area by the pool and beach. And I'm gonna go get an iced coffee now. And we have Hottie over here coming out of, oh my fucking God. So, <laughs> so today I'm wearing this swimsuit. Do you like it, Colin? I like your swimsuit. I do like this one. And we're just gonna go swim at the beach. We, our resort is like right on a beach, so there's like a lot of like different kind of beaches, and there's a pool, and there's that cave that we swam in yesterday. We do have our spa appointment in the other cave today. So, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. So, this is like the cover up I'm wearing today. I'm gonna wear these white shorts. Look, there's like a stain right here, and it totally looks like I got my period on my shorts, but I don't care because I think this outfit's cute, and I don't think ever anyone's gonna think that. And I'm wearing like this really, really pretty bow in my hair. <laughs> it's from Love Shack Fancy. For those of you who watch my hauls leading up to now, this island trip, I always talked about, I, will, I would show you guys hauls on outfits I got for this trip, and like, uh, this top and that bow that I'm wearing right now is from like my hauls that I've been doing leading up to this trip. I got my iced coffee and coconut milk and this is where we're putting our things. These are our chairs and we're gonna go swimming and that is our view. 
Look how gorgeous. Love it. happened basically up in the clubhouse they have hors d'oeuvres around like evening and we have like our massage coming up and we wanted to get some food in our service before we have our couples massage um tomorrow's our anniversary and he asked us if we're celebrating anything and we said that it's our four years tomorrow so we have champagne here's two five and many more all these hors d'oeuvres and snacks they have are strictly for like honeymooners and people on their anniversaries and we're here! I can't believe we made it this far. We've been together as long as this channel has been going because I met Colin. We started dating the day we met and I met Colin three days into my vlog channel. So this is like our baby. You're the dad of everyone and I'm the mom. <laughs> We're on our way to our massage. I like it. Yeah, it's Colin's first massage, guys. Hey y'all, excuse the sound, that's actually tree frogs and I'm outside the cave right now. Oh my gosh. So that was the most lovely spa service I've ever received, but this was really embarrassing. So as you guys know, me and Colin got a couple's massage, so we're right next to each other. And then after that hour, Colin was dismissed and then I stayed an extra hour for a facial. And in the middle of my facial, I was already kind of feeling it during like the couple's massage, but during my facial, I started getting really nauseous because I just get motion sick so easily. Like I've been that way ever since I was a kid, like on rides or like long car rides or just like on boats. And earlier this week, I don't know if you guys remember, but when I showed you guys what like the beach property looks like on this resort, there's like inflatables where kids will like bounce each other or just like swim to, chill on. I've been getting really, really nauseous or like motion sick on those inflatables and while like combing the knots out of my extensions during the stay, I made myself motion sick just by combing the knots out of my hair. So I can't believe I didn't think twice about a floating dock slash massage table like on the water in the cave. I can't believe I didn't think about this, but it was a beautiful concept. It's a cave with tents, on floating docks in the water inside a cave. Like that is so cool. But in the middle of my facial, I threw up. Oh, well, I excused myself and I asked to go to the bathroom. They always ask you to go to the bathroom right before like services, especially two hours long. Cause I had the couple's massage first and then the facial, but I didn't take up that opportunity cause I didn't have to pee. I already went up at the clubhouse and we had the champagne. And then in the middle of my facial, I was like, I just can't do this anymore. Like I was so nauseated because I was on a standing item, which is a table on a floating item in the water. So 
yeah, I was just like really rocking, you know? And I went to the bathroom and I threw up and then I walked back to my facial like nothing ever happened and she finished my facial. So long story short, it was like probably the best massage slash facial I've ever gotten in my entire life. I would love to come to the spa all the time. I just should probably take Dramamine before. My esthetician was literally incredible. It just felt so good. And my favorite part of the facial was the pumpkin enzyme face mask. And for those of you who know me very well, know that I love pumpkin fragrance. I even brought my little pumpkin perfume to Bermuda as I showed you guys earlier in the get ready with me portion yesterday night. Um, I love pumpkin fragrance so I'm just having a blast and I'm gonna go check on Colin to see how he loved his couples massage he's actually sorry there's like gnats and stuff he's actually at the room right now and we're gonna go check on him so I went to go check on Colin after my facial and he's at the beach and he just told me he's all shy he ran in there actually he's looking for more but he's really shy right now but he told me he picked all these shells for me that is so sweet. I want to make a necklace out of them. Like this has a hole in it. Imagine like a short chain. Thank you, sweetie. Thank you. <laughs> so right now we're at dinner and there's live piano and it's gorgeous. But Colin, we have not heard yet how your first massage went. How was it? Well, well right now. What do you mean, do I want a massage? He just said if I want a massage, he's just gonna pour this all over me. So it was oily, huh? Yeah, but it felt really good. Yeah. She had her entire arm up my back. Like, yeah. Like that. It was like, it was like, and did it feel good? Would you get one again? Mm. I would, but. I think it's gonna top it here, so it kinda sucks that this is my first one. Yeah. Mm hmm. So mm -hmm. Alright guys, so that's it for this fancy vlog. Starting now, we're gonna start celebrating our anniversary. I mean, it's only 9 p.m. on the 24th, but our anniversary is tomorrow on the 25th, so we're gonna celebrate all night, all day tomorrow, and all night tomorrow night, and we're really, really excited. Um, thank you for shipping us for so long. I appreciate it. Hey booze, so as you can see, I'm home. I also just wanted a disclaim because I just like edited the video and my voice is like really, really low and my allergies were just going so crazy because of the humidity in Bermuda and my voice just totally sounded so different. So no one go hating on me that I sound like a man, okay? But uh, we miss Bermuda so much. I'm gonna give you like a little haul on the things that I got in Bermuda. Um, but I wanna show you guys something really cute me and Colin are doing right now. My baby and I have been sitting here putting together this little DIY frame. So here's all the seashells we got in the ocean that we liked and then there's like a little Bermuda license plate and we put like the Bermuda dollars in here and we got cute little stickers and stuff from Michaels and flowers. This is Lily Bermuda like where I got like the fragrance. Um, here's the pink sand. I mean, it doesn't look pink from here, but you can see little pink specks. And then we just got like scrapbooking. Yeah. Stuff. Put it all in there. Yeah. We have to do this. Oh, yeah, we have to do this. Colin got me this at a yard sale like months ago. Yeah, it's so, so we have to we fill this. Bermuda out of rope, and then this is. What are the odds we found that? Bamboo, and then it's just thin paper. We have to put our pictures in here. Yeah, it's so thin. We have to put cute pictures. In here. This is just so. I'm so Pretty. happy with it. It's so gorgeous. Where are we going to put it? Alright, let's go find a spot. I think we should put mm. it in our room. No, our room's too cluttered. Since it's mint green, I have to put it somewhere that's not mint green. So, axe. Can you hold this? Yep. And then again, right here. And then this that looks so nice, baby. We should put the Juliet box up there near like the little like plants and stuff. Maybe even put the plants on top of the Juli Romeo and Juliet box. Perfect. Wait, this, make sure the stick goes in the back. <laughs> there we go. I like it. I love it. 
It's gorgeous, honey. It started out you. as a mess, but we looked yeah. good. Yeah, our room's a mess right I now. I have a really bad burn from hot glue. Me too. So I'm gonna show you guys the things that I bought on vacation. I'm gonna start with this mug. Look how gorgeous it is. It's like a cute little pastel house because Bermuda's really well known for their pastel houses. And I just think it's gorgeous. You guys know how much I love coffee. Then I got this little like jar. And is this a sparrow? What is this bird? It's a long tail. Yeah, it's all over like the Bermuda dollars. Um, but the color pink is like, Bermuda's famous for the color pink because of their pink sand. I also got Bermuda pink sand but I used a lot of this on our little DIY frame. Um, but yeah, it's like a pastel pink sand. It's gorgeous. Um, but I think I'm gonna use this for like, to put my earrings or rings. Sorry, there's like hot glue like on my nails. I also got this cute little pastel sun visor. It's like coral pastel pink with like pastel florals and it says Bermuda and aqua blue and cursive. I love this. It's just so girly and so cute for like a casual day. And then there's this like coral. It looks orange on camera, but it's like a coral top. And it says pink sand and suntans. And it's just really, really comfy. It's a good pajama top. And then I got this little like pastel pink house keychain for my house key. So I went to Lily Bermuda. It was a gorgeous like perfumery. And I got sun kiss and coral. Sun kiss smells like um, vanilla and orange and coral is very floral and vanilla so they both have hints of vanilla and I'm obsessed with them they are like everything I've been wearing lately and then Colin got me these two little seashells in the gift shop because he knows I like DIYs and crafts he knows I'll probably do something with these and then Colin got me this Bermuda like bottle opener magnet because he says it looks like a key that says Bermuda on it. And if you guys don't know this, me and Colin's thing is keys. We both have matching key tattoos below our hearts on the left side of our ribs. So I think that was very thoughtful. So yeah, that was my haul. Oh, and let's see. 54 Bermuda dollars. <laughs> I want to do more arts and crafts. It's actually really fun. Okay. All right, guys. Well, that was it for this fancy vlog. Let us know in the comments down below how much you like Bermuda vlogs because me and Colin, one day when we like have kids, we want to raise them in Bermuda. I really like want. Them. I, I feel like I'm supposed to be on an island, man. Yeah, like we're go, gonna end up there. Go spear fishing every day. Go fishing and oh my gosh, it'll be so fun. We can go um diving for like lobsters and stuff. Be awesome. Jet skiing. Mm-hmm. Love so cute. All right, well, we eventually want to have a second home there. I actually didn't tell the channel this yet, but um, I don't know if I should say it in this vlog, but 